Hello, welcome back to the water. My name is Reese, and I'm back with uh, Furaraba. I'm gonna keep this part short, by the way. Uh, also, my feet hurt. A lot. Anything else I wanted to say? Not really. Anyways, let's keep. Let's go for Imaria now. Oh? Huh? Spot him when he's walking by herself. Perfect, let's talk to her. You know how to? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Eh, it's not that I needed anything in particular. Okay, now what should I talk about? Yes, indeed, what should we talk Talk about. Oh, by the way, I ate way too much before this. Oh, feel about ready to burst. Hmm. Weekends holiday. It's just me or does this time get like really crowded on the weekends. They're okay too. Makes you really wonder, like, where the heck do all these people come from? やっぱりデートスポットとしてそれなりに有名だからじゃないかな。It's no surprise all the roads are paved and every single roadside flower bed is maintained to the T. 本当にどこも綺麗に咲いてるよね。公園の芝生や植木もしっかりと管理されているから、それで人も多いのかな。でも街の活気と景観の両立はすごく難しそうだよね。Mm, yeah, too many people can be a problem in and of itself. That, like, kind of like how flower viewing parties end up sometimes. Like, you know, there's some people who come see the beautiful cherry blossoms, but still don't give a crap and leave their trash all over the place. Things sometimes they have people picking up trash and stuff around the town as part of volunteer cleanups. When I think about it, those people seriously deserve some respect. I should join all those volunteer cleanups if I get the chance. Uh... Go for it. Wait. What do you do when you don't have when you don't have school? So you're an indoorsy type person, huh? When you're reading manga or playing games at home, do you ever get that feeling where time just slips away from you? Once you realize it, you're like, oh, I'd probably take a break, but you just get so caught up in it, you spent the rest of the day doing it. Better rest while you can. Better get enough sleep at night then. It's like this game has chastised me for playing it currently. Fuck you too, game. And also, gaming and reading can lead to dry eyes if you strain your eyes too much, so it's physically important to take breaks. Also, you know, for gaming by glasses with blue filter. Which I had 
believe. Uh, isn't the cheapest they go for like 70 dude, euros? At least why I, I'm currently interning at. I think it was like the flu filter itself was like, oh fucking no. I keep meaning to look into it because a friend of mine asked me about it at one point, but I continuously forget. <laughs> like, not even glasses with uh, actual strength. I don't know what else to say, what else to call it. Actually, I can just look it up real quick. Glass of strength. It's literally just glass of strength, apparently, according to Google Translate, and I'm too lazy to look deeper into it. Anyways. Huh, <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Aside from breaks, I also heard that uh, warming a wet towel in the microwave and putting it on your eyes like an eye mask helps too. <laughs> Talking to you like this really brings back memories, you know. <laughs> Alright, let's go back then. <laughs> nice, looks like I'm on a roll today. Let's go. You know that. Let's see. Hmm. Let's go with small talk. Here it's that and that. Around when do you get up every day? Oh, hey. That's what's going on for me as well right now. I'd like to get up later, but I can't. Yeah, you're not much of a morning person if I remember. Do you use your alarm? Yeah. You wanna know your mistake? You set only one alarm, probably. Oh, so like it takes you roughly until you're on your way to school before you fully wake up? Drinking fresh water right after waking up is supposed to help. I've heard that drinking fresh water right after waking up is supposed to help get your mind working properly. Sounds like it's worth a shot, but um, hmm. Guess you need to watch out and make sure you don't roll too much in your bed and knock it over. Small talk. Dang nice weather I haven't recently, don't you think? Dang nice weather we're having recently, don't you think? Yeah, but the downside is you get ridiculously tired during classes now. Can't possibly win against those warm rays of the sun. When I think of the alternative, the rainy season, I'd actually be kind of fine getting drowsy. I mean, it's not that much better when you have... Uh, when it's hot out. 
since it'll get sticky from the sweating. Yeah, if you hate the rain, those days are the worst. Mm. Uh, but if you think about it, we'd run out of water without rain. In the worst case, we'd have a rice shortage because of that too, and also problems with securing enough drinking water. Don't think a dumbass like you would think that much. Nah, not usually. I just happen to remember watching these t this TV special about the subject. <laughs> Seeing that made me realize how limited water actually is when you think about it. And also, I started to be a little wiseful about how I use water. Oh, Huh? Was it? Hmm. Didn't know that. As a pain to over nothing. Ah, <laughs> we ended up talking a lot longer than I thought. Uh, you better get on back to the classroom. Don't want Nonomura feeling on lonely, all lonely without you, right? <laughs> Maximum overdrive! Ah, oh, she's gone. So, uh, I suppose next we're going to go for school life. Oh, yeah, did you hear we're supposed to be getting more vending machines this month? Uh-huh, <laughs> Yeah, definitely. They didn't really have enough vending machines for the number of students we have going here. They didn't really have... I did read that correctly, I'm a fucking idiot. Seems like they're aiming to double the total number of vending machines in the cafeteria is where they'll place the majority of them. Uh, Mm, depends on what the vending machines have, but yeah, I'm sure I sure hope the students spread out among all the vending machines so we can get shorter lines. What would you like the new vending machines to have? I'd personally love to see strawberry milk. What else? Yeah, I'd love to see more vari variation in cafe. Fuck you. Kinda sucks to only have black when some people don't drink black, so I'd always appreciate some more diversity, like lightly sugared coffee in a ca cafe au lait. That's a great idea. Having a broad assortment of just different kinds of milk. Yeah, that'd be seriously cool. That'd be like seriously cool. <laughs> a milk craze, huh? It's kind of funny when you think about a craze being over something healthy like that. <laughs> uh, school life. Ventilation in the setting in your classroom is seriously great, don't you think? Uh... Mm. 
にこれからの時期はすごく助かるよね。Said it like with ACs, wind blowing from the outside is just as effective as a like a sleeping pill or something. <laughs> or beautiful weather coupled with just the right amount of wind. That's basically like you're being told to go to sleep. When it comes, that's when I'll worry about it. あ、わざ。だって春とか夏は涼しくていいと思うけど、冬になったら窓を閉めてても寒そうだし。Yeah, we got play ahead for that. Yeah, when it comes down to it, I think the only real thing we can do to fight the cold is wearing layers, several t shirts below, and then a sweatsuit or uniform on top. What about placing a huge amount of pocket heat is beneath your uniform? It should be a lot better, appearance wise. Hmm. It's, it's proving quite difficult to find something that effectively balances protection against the cold while simultaneously not ruining your appearance. Possibly as a last resort,、uh, maybe we could all bring blankets from home. And fuck, and those with windows seats get nice, expensive quilt blankets provided by the school. Okay, I have the perfect idea. I'll join you and come to school wearing a skirt too this winter. What? Talking to you like this really brings back memories, you know? Yeah, that's back to having, being something we've seen before. School life. So, we're upperclassmen. How's it? Feel to have kids younger than us here now. うーん、そうだね。一応先輩になった自覚は持っておいた方がいいかな。あ、see、あ、see、and why is that?えっと、やっぱり1年生から見れば2年生も3年生も両方先輩には違いないし、あとは部活とか委員会になると1年生にいろ
Let's just be casual about it and it'll be smooth sailing. <laughs> well, it's important to be easy going every once in a while. I mean, if you're constantly worrying about each and every little thing, you'll now find the time to enjoy school. Did you know the principal has a new tr toupee? What? You know, I don't think I've ever seen you come late to school. You know, that, uh... <laughs> yes, but not everyone's gung ho for a perfect attendance record, you know? Hmm, you think that? I'll give you that it's awkward, but but embarrassing? In my opinion, it'd be more embarrassing if you like tripped and fell and flashed your panties to everyone around you. Huh? Uh, hold on, why did you get so rat in the face just because I mentioned panties? Yeah, you're just kind of hurting yourself by coming late. うん、そうだね。遅刻しすぎると内心点も下がっちゃうし、先生から目をつけられたら本当に大変。wasn't there some of the rule, like, if you have two tardies, that counts as one day of absence from school? Um, that doesn't help you in any getting into university. And if you're constantly late, there's the possibility of you being held back a year. I imagine it'd be a huge turnoff on job applications too. I mean, if you can't come to school on time, how are they gonna trust you to come to work every day and do what you're supposed to do? If a company like that were out there, I'd be on my knees begging for them to hire me. Talking to you like this really brings me uh, back to skipping. There you go, you buddy. Oh, I kind of wish we'd gotten into class C, don't you? Yeah. Uh, you know how class A always gets first priority in our grade level when it comes to practically anything? School events, school assemblies, you name it. I just don't really like that. それは逆に考えたらいいんじゃない?どのクラスよりも先に行動できるからお得みたいな。I see, looking at it from another perspective, huh? Gotcha, so then let's try thinking of something positive about getting in class A. Around next to the bathrooms. I know, we're right next to the bathrooms. We, the students of Class A, have the special privilege of being able to just run across the hall when the time, when the time comes. <laughs> For people with weak stomachs, the difference in restroom distance can literally mean the difference between life and death. We can definitely take that as a huge merit. <laughs> now I feel sad for those poor chumps in Class C. They have to travel a whole 20 meters extra when they have to go. Eh? So, so 
I know I haven't really measured or anything, but I'd estimate it at around that. Those extra 20 meters can really prove fade for people with weak stomachs. <laughs> <laughs> and apparently, you will need to select one option not listed here, choose whichever you prefer. So, of course, I'm gonna go for the fucking toupee one. Or, hold on. Let's not go for that one. <laughs> Actually, let's go with that. So, uh, what are your thoughts on us getting in the same class af again after all this time? <laughs> yep, I see. Looks like there's a topic she isn't interested in. Oh, I guess it'd be, I'd better, we'd better start heading back to class. That was just fucking boring. Let's go with toupee. Yeah, that the principal has a new toupee. Huh? Why are you interested in the principal's new toupee? She doesn't seem interested in this topic. I guess we, I guess we'd better start heading back to class. Sorry, I took up so much of your time. Oh, that wasn't too bad, I guess. Maximum overdrive! Coupons for the Internet Cafe Pleasure Club. Feel free to take one. Pleasure Club. Please come visit. I've worked today until evening. We're going on eight hours now. I've been handing out coupons for this internet cafe with a very, uh, questionable name. Not as much if it's over, I write up my work report at the store, then hurry on home so I can finally do something enjoyable. Phew. Wipe my hair with a bath towel and switch on the TV. But standing for the up for the better half of the day, so naturally my legs are jelly by now. Oh, I feel that one right now. I feel that one right now. I feel that one right now. I have just the idea. It's been a while since I've had the house to myself like this. So time to watch porn on the big screen in the living room. Tadaima. Rats. My plans have been thwarted. thwarted. You scared me, Mom. I hardly ever see you come home this early. Oh, okay, have fun. I randomly zap through the channels and sip on some barley tea. Huh? What? We're going over to their place? Are you seriously fucking doing this? Oh, my god, no. I just say no. I just say straight up no. This man was walking around handing out coupons for eight hours straight, what he said, as someone who currently is experiencing something very similar. Just add to that a two ma two kilometer walk from the station to the workplace, and then after work another two kilometer from the workplace to the station, with one fourth of the way that being an estimate being a giant ass staircase for some fucking reason. I very much feel him right now. Don't fucking talk to me. I just want to lay down. And let my legs finally die. Have to tell me that mom also starts to get ready herself. Boy, back up here. How many goddamn years has it been now since I last went to Himari's place? You know, it's nothing special for my mom because she still goes over there na every now and then. Damn, I'm kind of nervous. After suddenly being told I'm paying a visit to my childhood friend's house for the first time in ages, I couldn't stop my heart from beating wildly and tension from gripping my whole body. Oh, 
ついでに具足も連れてきました<笑>待ってました玄関開いてるから入ってきて The, the moment is here I ultimately ended up being dragged here by my mom The damn is awkward We may jump, jump, maybe childhood friends, sure, but、uh, now we're not even really close. We're just merely in the same class. Not even worried about her not liking me anymore or anything. I just, I'm just straight up nervous. <laughs> um, sorry,、uh, but could I possibly go back home? <laughs> Whimper. So here I am. At Himri's house for the first time in what feels, seems like a million years. The postponing of the living room. The positioning of the living room furniture hasn't changed at all, and even the scent of the place strikes a bit of a nostalgia in me. <laughs> Hi, nice to see you again. Uh, I'm not! Oh, don't you still do you still? Maybe true, but that doesn't mean we're constantly talking with each other and hanging out together like we used to. Relationships with the opposite sex are very sensitive things for kids our age. I want you to realize that, please. Uh, now, how I would love to shout that at them right now, but alas, I can't. Yep, they were both on a, a thousand yen, actually. My mom puts the two bottles of wine on the table and lines up the wine glasses she brought from home. I wonder if anybody's in her room. She's nowhere to be seen in the living room, and it's dinner time too. Oh,、well, maybe she's out doing some shopping. She slides the door to Himari's room open, which is incidentally next to the living room, and goes to wake her up. That、uh, takes me back. I spent a lot of time playing with Himari in that very room. She's just gonna head out in pajamas. Where? Mom? Yes? How about you tell me next time? Nah. <laughs> Himani's drowsy voice escapes from her room. We,、uh, we already do know that she absolutely despises carrots. Oh, damn, what is she doing? It's seven in the evening for Pete's sake. What, what the hell kind of sleep cycle is she on? <laughs> Looks like it. Carrots were always one thing she absolutely wouldn't eat. Her aversion was so strong and ardent that you could practically call it hatred. Is that fucking drool? That is! That is drool! She's just straight up drooling. Also, I quite like her with her hair down. Oh.、Uh, hi. Nice to see you. お邪魔してます。お母さん、リビングにパンダが2匹もいる。パンダ。あんた何すれのこと言ってるのよ。自分の幼馴染の顔も忘れちゃったの。はい。<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><
<laughs> Some really na loud sounds are coming from inside our room. I guess she must be tidying up her room in a hurry or something. <laughs> you know what? I don't. If I don't know what to use as a thumbnail, I'll just have this. I said I have this. There we go. T take however long you need. いまりちゃんと相変わらずなのね。少しは落ち着いたと思ってたんだけど、逆よ、逆。むしろ言いたいことは好き放題言うようになっちゃって。最近じゃ私の言うことすら聞かないんだから。大丈夫現物しちゃ
I decided to dig into the dinner, the main focus being the beef stew. Oh, that's good stuff. Whenever we have stew, my mom always makes cream stew, so I very rarely get the opportunity to have beef stew. Mother of God, this meat is so tender, I'm in heaven. <laughs> so, no matter how great the beef stew is, I just have no idea what to do with that, he muddy. But damn, it is awkward. It's fairly easy to act normal like friends at school, but uh, when we're at some place where we are, there are fewer people around, or at her house, no less, and at her la house, no less, that becomes exceedingly difficult. I definitely couldn't call her by her first name like I used to in the past, but that thing's becoming awkward. What makes this such an awkward situation above all else is that we know each other's past so well. Mm -hmm. um. It's just as awkward for her as it is for me. Well, no duh. The very idea of a high school boy eating dinner at the house of a girl in his class that isn't his girlfriend is plain wrong. Guess I'll just wait for my mom to get drunk and find the right time to, to slip away. なあ、いつもあらなそうな顔して食べてるのよ、二人とも。ごめんなさい。うちのひまりがあまりにもブサイクだから、ご飯が美味しく感じないのよね。What? <笑> My mom doesn't really care about throwing me under the bus at this point. You can never let your guard down around her. I mean, it, the things she'll say, you can't fight the right way to deny it. And, and she'll say them without hesitation. What the fuck just came out of her mouth? I, I really, really do not think a parent should be saying something like that. Let's do so, goddamn mom! You seem to be okay with us having a kid while still in high school. Are you mentally alright? So conversation is completely off the rails in the first place. I I haven't even had a girlfriend yet. <laughs> Following that, they both fall deeper and deeper down the slippery slope. I guess it's the alcohol kicking in. Yeah, it's gotta be. Dealing with their antics has been even more of a pain than usual. あんまり言いたくなかったんだけど、私たちがくっつくとかくっつかないとか残念ながらそういう話は一切ないから。何よ、しれっとした顔しちゃって。ひまりちゃん、お願いだからそんな寂しいこと言わないで。だって本当のこと
もちづきたまにあんたの口から聞いたことあるよな。Wait! Please! 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 I c o m p l e t e l y lost! Why did you bring up her? だ、だって、このまま二人に誤解されたままじゃかわいそうだと思ったから。Some tells me another misunderstanding is that the process of being bad on top of the already existing one. Seriously, let me set the record straight here, dammit. Your mom is literally on the verge of going nuts, Mary. So, so, Mochizuki san, te, don't na kona no? Anda, so, no kuni, make te nain de shou. She has tits. Wait, what? Make ru, make nai no hana shou sare te mo. Betsu ni watashi, rival de mo nan de mo nai shi. A, a, da te go a. Kono go ni o yon de nai tsuma tai koto itte ru no yo. だって本当のことだもん。In a way, it kind of hits hard hearing her say something like that so straightforwardly, but she's not wrong, so it's alright. で、その子どんな子なのよ。早く教えなさいよ。うーん。とりあえず、私よりも背が高くて、体も細くて、スラッとしてて。なのに胸は大きくて、腰回りもキュッとしてて。あとは、足も長くて綺麗かな。一言で説明するとモデルみたいな子あ,あんた惨敗じゃないの<笑><笑>うるさいなお母さんだってスタイルは人のこと言えないでしょ Now, she just call her mom ugly? <笑> Thus the mother daughter quarreling begins But、uh, yeah in my opinion ひまり isn't too bad looking yourself ねえひまりちゃんその子髪長いあはい綺麗なロングヘアですああ、なるほど。あの子ね。えなになに知ってるのたまーに駅前で一緒に歩いてるとこ見たことあるのよ。でもその時は周りに何人も他の友達がいたから、あまり気にはしなかったけど。But you are right not to. We're nothing more than friends. I just know her because we've been in the same class for the past few years. There's nothing at all going on between us. えそうなの No, heck. How did you even get the idea when we, that we were dating in the first place? Huh! Why did we not hear about that in Rino's route? Rizuki is pretty good looking, so sometimes talk like that does come up. But this is quite the shock. I've never, I never knew Himari was under that impression regarding us. I just said we aren't in any sort of relationship. Our two moms then bombarded me with questions for the next hour. I stuffed myself with beef stew to hide my embarrassment while explaining to them over and over again that they've got the wrong idea. Uh, well. Don't worry about it. At the end of the day, it's always a circus when those two are together. As always, conversation comes to a halt. I'd say it's, a, it's awkward, but to be honest, I've mostly gotten used to it at this point. So you still have pet hamsters? Spot a hamster cage located in a corner of, the, of her room. Inside, there is a hamster energetically running on a wheel. Um, I'm living in the living room, but I'm not sure what I'm doing. 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 Oh, that's cool. Now, Samson's used to be Fimity's favorite thing in the world. I remember she'd bring them over to my house every time she came over to play. I also remember having a hard time cleaning up all their little pallet-like poop. Um, Minahara? 
ひまりでいいよここ学校じゃないしあっオッケーそっちだって青葉くんって呼ばれたらなんか違和感ない That's the way. <laughs> Kyo chan. But! Anyway, you call me that nickname after so long makes my heart instantly skip a beat. Damn it, don't do this to me. My, the male heart is hard to keep under control at times. Man, I still remember your room from all those years back. It hasn't changed a bit. Um, so da ne. Watashi mo yogai to ka a m a r i s h i n a i kara. I spent a lot of time playing in her room back then. Space beside their house is a parking lot now, but it used to be an apartment complex where I lived. h i m i d i was always my playmate on weekends and holidays, so we were more than familiar with each other's houses. We don't talk at ease a bit at school. Don't, don't we talk at ease a bit at school? <laughs> uh, I've just. I've been just nervous, to be honest. Just felt weird after all this time. Like I don't know what to say to you or how to approach you. <laughs> Expounding on that further, I want to say that she's really gotten beautiful over the years. We haven't been. Over the years, we haven't been talking to each other. I guess it's just part of being a guy that suddenly makes my heart just skip a beat when I, when I let my guard. I guess it's just part of being a guy that she suddenly makes my heart skip a beat when I let my guard down. What's fuck? Like, what do you mean? Right, I'll see you back. Back then, I th thought you were avoiding me. But the fact of the matter is, despite us getting into the same school after so many years, not seeing each other, there was no semblance of a reunion. Far from it, we wouldn't even look at each other in the hallways. I think anyone in this situation would come to the conclusion that they were being avoided. To be perfectly honest with you, it felt kind of sad. Huh? How's that my fault? You were the one who didn't have a phone back then. Man, you just told me your number then. How else was I gonna send you a message? Oops, no, I don't. Here, you can jack. I'm personally sure my phone's address list practically full of only guys' names. See, it's not there. You've never told me your number. You ask your mom? Yeah, I never got anything like that. Oops. Well, oh shit, no wonder I didn't hear anything from you and Himiri then. Misunderstanding spanning years. Yoko, that's all on you, and I. Fuck. And I can't really just look past that. At those exact same thoughts? Would you believe it? Ah. <sighs> Both heave a hefty sigh. The situation couldn't be a more textbook example of uh, needless worrying. I seriously can't believe I, s I stressed myself out so much because of this until now. <laughs> oh, Yoko's dying. Oh, please do. But, yeah. I take my phone out of my pocket again. Comes uh, a few years late, but we can exchange numbers now. You know how to use the infrared thing? Uh, uh. She goes and fetches her phone from her table, brings it up to mine, and we exchange our contact data. <laughs> really? Anyways, I'll message you when I don't have anything to do. 
They opened the address list so I can double check that everything went th went through. After seeing him with his number listed there, I was immediately assaulted by this feeling. Like all the tension just rushed out of my body at once. <laughs> Coming! Yeah, it's already 10 p.m. Thanks. Yes, sir, you mom! I'm coming! Literally right now! <laughs> yep. No, there was nothing even remotely of that nature going on, so we'll be going home right now. I leave him in his house today, feeling glad that I came. Hopefully with this, all that- fuck, ho hopefully with this, all this awkwardness surrounding us will be gone for good. Alright then, thanks for the end of the day. Most of all, I feel really relieved that I finally got Himari's number. Whoops. <laughs> Skip. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Like I said, there's a short one. But I, I warned you. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. And see you next time. Bye-bye.